Hello, and thank you for joining us live from the National Harbor for this year's 2021 fall meeting, hosted by the National Defense Transportation Association and U.S. Transportation Command. I'm Captain John Perkins. But before the official events begin, I'm joined here by the new Transcom Commander, General Jackie Vanavos. Ma'am, thank you for joining us today. Morning, John. Now, ma'am, you've been to a few of these meetings before, so I'm kind of curious, what are you looking forward to most from about this today's event? Well, John, uh, first and foremost, the ability to see these defense and industry leaders face to face at the NDTA fall meeting, um, it really makes it so, such a rich experience. And then I think about how I want to absorb their experience. I really want to listen to what are the pain points across the enterprise and how are we working together to get after these challenges? Because when I think about the future and the strategic environment and how it's changing, I want to see how we can work better together with industry to tackle our problems. Well, ma'am, it's very interesting here. Earlier, we talked to Vice Admiral uh, Andy Brown, the CEO and president of NDTA. And one thing he mentioned, he was really excited that you're participating in this year's fall event. He also mentioned that he's looking forward to your remarks. Now, you're scheduled tomorrow, Tuesday at 9 a.m. to provide keynote uh, remarks. That said, when it's all said and done and you walk off the stage, what are you hoping the audience takes away from your remarks? Yeah, uh, first and foremost, uh, I just have the privilege to share what this entire enterprise has done over the last year. I think about how we've overcome COVID and we've had some pretty unique missions this year. So what a great opportunity to just really shower the praise on the team for what we've done this year. And then I think about the future, right? As a fresh leadership brings a fresh perspective. And what are we thinking about with the future as the strategic environment changes? You know, General Lyons did such a great job building the foundation and really um, a, a tighter cooperation with industry on how we can tackle the problems uh, of tomorrow together uh, better. And so I want to really talk about our warfighting construct, our, our, how our posture is going to be changing, uh, what we need out of capacity, and our strategic center of gravity, command and control, and then how industry can really help us become better together. Well, ma'am, thank you for that preview of your remarks tomorrow. And more importantly, thank you for joining us today. Thank you. Kickoff for the 2001 fall meeting begins in about two hours. But please remember to join us tomorrow at Tuesday at 9 a.m. for General Van Ovis' remarks, which you can watch live on defense.gov. Please follow U.S. Transportation Command on Twitter, LinkedIn, and Facebook. And please join me today at 4 o'clock when I talk to the head of the U.S. Navy's Maritime Sealift Command, Rear Admiral Mike Wetlaufer.